So recovery is probably one of the most underrated regimens and a lot of people even talk about training and they even overtrain at the gym and they forget to give their bodies enough time to properly rest and rejuvenate. Favorite recovery tips. Let's go. So, after a long workout week, I love drinking some hot tea with some lemon, and sometimes I add in some kava kava. I just put like a little drop of it, a little goes a long way. So, kava kava promotes relaxation when added to herbal teas, water, or even juice. Another thing that I love to do is taking magnesium flake baths. So this is the Now Solutions Magnesium Flakes. You just draw a bath and you put these in there and it dissolves. Magnesium Flakes are a soothing addition to the bath and an ideal natural bath additive for softening the skin. And what I like to do is also add in some essential oils. So the aromatherapy benefits of the essential oils can be really relaxing. It's revitalizing and centering. So by my bed I have an essential oil diffuser and I put in these little droplets. This one's really fun. It's called Cheer Me Up from now and it has some orange oil, lime oil, grapefruit, lemon oil and it smells so good. Helps me relax and just go to sleep and it helps with the air quality. Another one of my tips is I love taking astragalus. I've been experimenting with astragalus and in Chinese medicine a lot of herbs and little tonics and soups they add astragalus but you can actually get it in capsule form if you don't. Astragalus is known for its adaptogenic quality so adaptogenic properties really help to balance the imbalance of your body and if you're taking a lot of caffeine or you're stressed out you're doing high intensity training you probably want to take something that has an adaptogenic herb so it actually helps you kind of chill out and there you have it, you guys. Those are my tips on how to recover your body. Let me know in the comments below what you've tried before, and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. You